So we're gonna talk about seven reasons to fast. And number one reason is autophagy. So everybody say autophagy together. That is literally our body's natural process of getting rid of old damaged cells, debris, even pathogenic bacteria. Um, our body can clean those things up. Fasting jazzes that up. Uh, stem cell surge. So we know stem cells are so important for energy and repair in our body. And we're talking about repair in your knee or your liver or your thyroid. Like it doesn't matter um, whether it's musculoskeletal or your organs. These stem cells are going to the place that your body needs them the most. So that's really amazing. You don't have to tell them where to go. Um, elevated ketones. This is really amazing. So much research is being done about how when our brain and our body are burning ketones properly, um, it just, it, clarity of thought. Um, we have our maximum amount of physical capabilities. A lot of the research is, is being done by Dominic D'Agostino and, um, oh, he's a doctor in Florida, Florida State maybe, um, but the research they're doing is even with Navy SEALs because those people, we know they maybe ha don't have access to food or enough sleep and they have to be performing absolutely at their best. Um, so, I mean, we could go on and on about ketones and, and the importance of your brain actually burning them um, and using them. So, energy diversion, this happens when we're fasting because guess what, your body, is not uh, focused on digesting food all day long. The average American eats 17 times a day. And one thing I can attest to is I got a wicked cold about three days ago. And we have been fasting for three days and my cold is almost gone. When was the last time you got a cold and it was almost gone in three days? Um, I can definitely just feel that working in my body healing. Um, hormone optimization. So we get a massive rise in growth hormones. This is really amazing. And it's not just during the fast. It's also maybe even a month or two longer. Um, your body continues to raise the growth hormone, which is going to eat away the fat cells and help you build muscle. Um, also, hormone optimization um, are, are sex hormones, thyroid hormones, insulin, leptin, all of those things are going to be um, regulating. Uh, number six, it resets the DNA. This is really amazing. We now know that 97% of diseases are caused by our environment. Only 3% are genetic. So our DNA has specific codes on it and those codes can be turned on or turned off. For example, Dr. Pompa is a very, very thin, athletic, strong man and 3% body fat, but he says he has the obesity gene. But guess what, it's not turned on. And so fasting gives us the power to turn off bad genes and turn on good ones. Um, it helps us to reset our microbiome. We know our gut, our gut is our second brain. Our gut is so important. Everything is stemming from that, our immune system, um, so many things. And so uh, when you fast, it stresses the body and just allows that to heal, allows the bacteria to regulate, um, the bad ones to die off, the good ones to continue growing. Uh, so there's seven reasons to fast. If you've never thought about fasting or you kind of thought about fasting, maybe some of those things are, are really worth looking into and um, probably worth, worth your time. Thanks.